Hello and welcome back to Lumosity. Ready to begin our training? Uh, why? Why must it always start at the same? No, it doesn't. Sometimes we start off with a faulty screen load. Sometimes I'm all like, Hello and welcome back to Star Wars The Ultra. Uh, uh, I mean, Lumosity. Uh, yes, totally Lumosity. Ah. Uh, you know what I mean? All oh, this time in this heavy, me trying to tell you that you do some wrong with feeling it. Yeah, that's your fault. Anyway, I'm apparently feeling good today because I just pressed it and I uh, slept for a round. Uh, this room is extremely hot. Oh, hold on. I'm, uh, while I think of this number, I'm going to go turn the air down because I am burning to a crisp. Stay crispy and stay right here for like five, no, four, no, three. Okay, I'm, I'm going and going to talk to you from here. All right, don't go anywhere. Don't stay. <coughs> I'm back, baby. I'm not a baby. Hmm. Fooled me. <laughs> Not. Quite the opposite, really. Uh, how many hours? I don't even... I didn't even think about it. Um. Hmm. Hmm. Well, I've gone over the limit, so I'm just going to go with seven, which is normal. You know, just the default. Seven. Pff, I don't remember. <laughs> That'll be good enough. Urban flu. I think it was around that range. <clears throat> Ebb and flu. If it ever loads. Ah! Night. So, what are the riddles? Uh, 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 are you gonna slap me with today, huh? Well, today is your lucky day. Oh, I seriously doubt that. Because I. I'm going to be telling you a story of my own creation, written by me into my mind, just to about 15, uh, let's see how much time I waste, up oh, 30 minutes before now. Time flies, and when I'm telling this story, it so will not seem like it, because it's gonna be bad. Hold on to your vomit bucket, hold it close, and try not to wrench your guts out. And begin! Once upon a time. Oh, why does it have to start out with that every time? No, oh, it's just my stud story protocols. You know, just, just, the, oh, it's the shortest opening fanfare I can give myself. And there has to be fanfare. There has to be some kind of glory in my speech. Otherwise, I feel like I'm just static and just not doing anything of importance. <laughs> It's all overacting and that sort of thing. Yeah, you get what I'm saying here. <clears throat> Once upon a time, there was this guy. And this guy was all like, oh, I had a weirdest dream last night. There were so many cows in it. It's so weird. Anyway, listen. And I thought, I was a cow. What a, what a, what a terrible dream. And he goes to his door in his house. Except his house looks more like a barn than a house. But he thinks nothing of it. Nothing at all. He opens the door. And who is out there but cows? Cows! Oh, so many cows! And they're like... Mmm. 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 And he's all like, Jacob, what are you doing sounding like a cow, looking like a cow? What, what happened to you? Meow. <laughs> Sorry, that's, that's the best dramatic story sound I can give you. <clears throat> Basically, there's supposed to be drama. Like, he's all like, ah, it's a cow. Everywhere. Except, 
with the very next scene of my very poorly thought out story. A guy wakes up. Except that guy was a cow who was dreaming he was a human. <laughs> that was all a dream of this cow, you see. Except, <gasps> there's another except. Except this cow who is dreaming of being a person is actually merely a character in a video game being played by a moose. No, no, it was a human, just a human. <laughs> the human who maybe looks like a mute moose. I hadn't really thought about it, but I guess now that I think about it, he does look like a moose, doesn't he? Except he is really named Moosey. Moosey the Goosey. He's a goose like human. Who is, in fact, one character in a video game played by the old man? What? Oh no, you've figured out my secret. I'm a gamer. Oh, the stigma. Just social stigma. Oh, there's no stigma anymore. Be ridiculous. Come on, video games are cool now. Oh, not in my business. Oh. No, in your business, everyone's dead. Long ago. What was your business again? Oh, that's right. You don't have a word for it anymore, because it's so long dead, there's no one has used it in 400 years. I'm really grave. That's what we used to call it. And then everyone died. You're right. Why don't you have to bring back so many memories? Ah! And of course, it would seem obvious that, in fact, this old man is simply a figment of my imagination, and so all the story is also my imagination. It's like, and the old man is part of my imagination, which is about him and this story. And they're all, it's all, it's all me. In fact, I am the story. <laughs> oh, the narcissism just kills me <laughs> in a good way. <laughs> <laughs> I love the sweet irony of it. <laughs> oh, you're not going to love that score as soon as you figure out how bad it is. What? What score? I'm uh, playing a game? Oh, oh no! Oh, it's a th no, it's terrible! Seven fish on the fifth day? That is just so bad. What loser did that? <laughs> Oh, man. Well, that story was, I thought it would be longer than it was. I guess we need to think of, fit some more things in this episode, eh? Well, okay. Contra! <laughs> Star Wars The Republic joke. Just met AK Contra again today while I was playing by myself, and so it wasn't anything you'd know about, except AK Contra features in a few videos as a background character who plays a lot of war zones, as it would seem, and remains approximately lion metal, so I stay up with her, you know, just... She's always the group leader, and I'm all like, Your leading sucks! Or something like that. I love bashing better leaders than I. It makes me feel better. Slightly. Does my own leadership. Yes, I am a leader in some war zones. Leading my squad of idiots to supreme doom. Yeah, and they weren't really idiots. Just a leader. But who is more foolish, eh? The fool? Or the fools who are, who follow him. <laughs> yeah, that's 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 Obi Wan Kenobi for you. Or probably George Lucas. 
speaking through Obi-Wan Kenobi, because no one knows Obi-Wan Kenobi is the voice of wisdom in Star Wars. He's pretty much the, you know, Yoda, sure Yoda's got really sweet moves as a Jedi. Sure he says some stuff backwards so it sounds like he's saying it with wisdom. But who's the real wise one? Alec Guinness. Alec Guinness. I mean Obi-Wan Kenobi. Definitely. Sir Alec Guinness, I should say. And then I guess you could say that, you know, in the prequel trilogy, you've got the young Obi-Wan Kenobi saying some good stuff, but I, I, I've yet to find it. I mean, it's okay, but it's just okay. Yay? Nay. Well, hey. <clears throat> On to the riddles. I've got a good one here for you, if I can just remember it. If you are familiar with the game The Witch's House, then you have nightmares every day. In the day, in fact. Also, daymares. Or at least it's just me. It's the big skull to Sorry, just a daymare. <clears throat> anyway. The, uh, if there's a riddle in that sto in that game, which I'm trying to remember now. How's it go again? Hmm. Hmm. Um. Well, it's gone. Wait, I, I was gonna say something. I was gonna say a riddle I had just thought of, but I, that one was gone too. Ah, oh, they're all disappearing as I come to them. All right, well, here's one that will never disappear as I come to it. There are five sh Okay, I just messed it up. Arr! On your way to Dantooine, you'll be in a ship. Dantooine's a planet. All right, you're in space. Space! Space! You're in space. You're in a ship. You're traveling to Dantooine, and on your way there, you encounter five ships... Also on the way to Dantooine. Only five, all right, no trick question. <laughs> there. And on each of those five ships is five crewmen. And for each of those five crewmen is five pets. Now, how many in all are going to Dantooine? Hmm? Hmm? Wait. I just ruined it. Those brother ships were not going to Dantooine. That was a trick question. <laughs> they were supposed to not be going to Dantooine. They were coming from Dantooine. Ah! A big face palm. Again. All right, Kunal. I, I'm the idiot of the hour. <laughs> and that's a difficult accomplishment to accomplish. Oh, man. All right, milk for you, chocolate milk for you. I haven't messed it up yet. Ah, someone probably did just mess this game up. I'm playing familiar faces. I'm better than them. I'm not the most idiotic idiot of the hour. Yes. Hello, Heather. I'm the idiot of the hour. Maybe. At least second. Runner-up idiot of the hour. Wouldn't you like a guy who's a something of the hour, or runner-up of something of the hour? Doesn't matter what. Oops. Yes. Oop. Oops. Come on, chicken's good for you. Oh, God, I hate chicken. I don't blame you. Oh, I do not like. I don't know why exactly. Just never, never caught the taste for it. Uh, I did another game, a game that I, even an idiot, can do well at. Speed perk. Though my brain power may be limited, its speed at limitedness is very fast. Grammar fail. <laughs> Let's go. Well, while I figure out what the other riddle was. Okay. Um, something about... Okay, that's bad. 
If I have to say something about you, no, it's not going to be good. Uh, you know what? Why don't I just focus on doing well in this game? You know, that way I'll be able to say I did something, accomplished something during this episode. All right, let's do that. If I make random sounds, I will have an easier time concentrating. And when I'm saying random sounds, gibberishness, there's no brain power in it required at all. That made no sense. You see, even if I were to speak anything at all, it would not make sense anyway, so it's no point, and it did still slows me down, because I noticed after the fact that it did not work out the way I'd anticipated, and because I just got on this huge ramble streak, I just spreed. Instead, actually, spreed is better word there, and all of that made me fail on the time for those few rounds, so you can probably see now that that is not a good idea, and as of this very moment right now, not the time before now, but this time, right now, the time that is now, I am stopping this ramble speak. Stopping. That's, that's what I'm talking about, ending here. Woo! Breath taken. Ramble speak begins again. In actuality, it takes less brain power than you might think. Oh, I can think that, uh, definitely, uh, it makes sense. Top five score! And speed match is the game I don't do war! <laughs> oh, so many links to get rhymes there. A bore. In fact, you might say it's a game I adore. Ah. <laughs> uh. What's the other r riddle? Come on, I'm better than this. Back in the day, I could tell riddles like they were fiddles. Ha 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 ha. Telling a fiddle. Yeah. Okay. Ah. Uh, I've just ribbled myself out to this one. Oh dear. I'm just. Should I shut up? Yes. Yeah, I yeah, I probably should, huh? Well, it's convenient that I should shut up because it's almost the time when I will be required by time and boringness restrictions to finally shut up in addition to requirements that I breathe or I die. It's called physics. Breathing is required. It's not called physics. It's called biology or anatomy or botany or something, whatever I am. Not botany. Animality. Animality. Ah, but... Beep squeak!